Quick question. Have you ever heard that there are approximately 1,000 earthquakes every year in Canada? If you don't believe me, take a look at the seismic map. So, if you want to learn a bit more about the preparedness for Cascadia, then you should continue watching this video. First, let's consider Canada's west coast. Now, let's look at the initial scenario. All the communities are being supplied by different modes of transportation, such as ships and trucks. The model considers that after an earthquake, ports can be inoperable, roads can be blocked, and communities can be isolated by land. The question that we are trying to solve is, how can we combine multiple modes of transportation to deliver emergency supplies to affected communities? The model considers different resources, such as road clearing teams, trucks, barges, ferries, and helicopters. Then, it creates different routes for each one of the modes. The results are displayed on a map, as it is easier for stakeholders to understand the interaction between the modes. Finally, this model is used to answer what-if questions applied to different scenarios. This way, decision makers can have other ideas to improve the emergency plan for Cascadia. Thanks for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed learning a bit more about my research.